Good morning. So, just got my hot cup of coffee and I want to try the Starbucks non-dairy creamer. This is in Caramel Macchiato. I am pumped about it. I always like the Starbucks creamers, but they hurt my stomach, as do a lot of dairy creamers. Um, here is the nutritional info if you are interested. And yeah, it's almond milk and oatmeal, oatmeal and oat milk. And I'm pumped. I'm gonna wait for my coffee to cool just a little bit. Um, and we'll come back and do a little taste test. I love, I seriously, I love this so much. I love this so much. Oh my gosh. Honestly, I wasn't thinking I was going to be like raving about it because sometimes like I think the Starbucks coffee that's bottled and I am like very aware this is an unpopular opinion. I think it tastes like water. Like it just doesn't do it for me. It's not strong enough. There's like nothing there for me. If I add anything to it, it suddenly just tastes like watered down whatever I added, like creamer or watered down protein shake. Like there's just nothing there. Um, but it's still fun to try the Starbucks products. And so I was a little bit worried about this creamer, but honestly, it's so good. Um, I have never had a hot caramel macchiato from Starbucks, so I couldn't really tell you if it's similar to that, but I will say it tastes really good. It's a good amount of sweetness. Um, and it kind of just has like this full flavor. I don't know. I really like it. It's sweet, but not overly sweet. Um, I mean, it's like a sweet creamer. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, I really like it. So highly recommend the non-dairy one. They also have a hazelnut latte flavor, I think. Um, I'm just not a hazelnut fan, so I didn't want to pick that one up, but I really like this. I have um, been using the same, the coconut so delicious creamer for like six months. And so this is a nice change and I'm very excited. I hope that it sticks around and I hope they come out with like a fall the fall flavor too so i'll keep you posted i'm gonna drink my coffee and i'll catch up with you guys in a bit he says mom how dare you film about your coffee and not play with me how dare you <laughs> are you over my shenanigans chancy are you over it and then we've got a little mr diva over here that dang blue shirt is still sitting there. It's been there for a week. Oh my gosh. Yeah, watch this fight about to happen. <gasps> Y'all are so good. Oh my goodness. Look at my babies. Hi. So I'm about to have lunch. This is just leftover meal prep. So I've got some ground turkey with black beans, just like taco meat, um, some Spanish cauliflower rice. Honestly, I much prefer the Rotel or diced tomatoes. The crushed tomatoes was like overly tomatoey. It was really hard to get like a Mexican flavor and really it just kind of tastes like tomato cauliflower. But anyways, I'm having that. Um, and I'm just gonna use the leftover lettuce and tomato that I didn't eat this week, sour cream, a little Taco Bell sauce, and some salsa. Okay, y'all, very exciting. I have some packages and I'm freaking pumped. They are gonna be two things I've never been more excited about. Please hold. Okay, so this is something I ordered from Ellie. Um, Facebook ads over months convinced me. So I went with the, Ellie is basically like a subscription service um you pay for it monthly and then every month you can log in and like pick which outfit you want so they have different ones they have like a two-piece set a three-piece set or a five-piece set so i went with the five piece it's more expensive as you get more things the five piece comes with accessories so i might bump down now that i have i really just got it because i liked the accessories i don't know what else accessories they would have i'll have to see what's on it next month um i believe it was like 50 dollars, and then i got um like $10 off with some random code. I'll see if I can find it for you. I got some type of deal. 
Um, but okay, let me show you. So they sent some like samples of like a sports drink you add to water. Um, one of the accessories is these resistance loops. So you can see like work out with them with your legs. Here's an arm option. Um, and then the reason I really chose that one instead of just the outfit with the accessories was because it came with an armband for your um, phone while you're working out. So I just thought, oh, it's like attached. Okay. I just thought that was cool and I needed one. It's something I was going to order anyways. So, you know, why not get it included? So this looks pretty cool. It's the Bally Total Fitness brand. And yeah, I'll let you guys know how it is. So then I picked out, I saw the, um, let me start with the top because I saw the top, which is why I ordered this. I just couldn't resist. And I'm already mad because a few months ago I saw a pattern that I really wanted and it's already been like, a, they switch patterns every month. So that one's gone now. And I still regret not ordering back then. So this is the Jessica Simpson Active line. So they have all types of brands and then you just pick the cute stuff. So tell me this like wind hoodie, cheetah hoodie or whatever this pattern is, is not giving you life right now because it's giving me life and I couldn't be more excited. So it's got a half zip, it's got these little ties, I'm pumped. It looks like it's got pockets. The material, I mean, you would think this jacket by itself would be $50, but for, I mean, I got a discount, but say I paid the full 50, I got a jacket, I got leggings, a sports bra, two like sports related accessories and a free water bottle. So let's just keep going. I'm so pumped for this whole matching ensemble. Okay, so next are the leggings. I went ahead and got the large, I think. Did I get the large? Yeah, I got the large. So these, so cute, black with the full stripe down the side. Let's see if these have a retail price on them. No. Does this say it? Also no. So I don't know how much this would be or if it's Jessica Simpson, you know, designed it specifically for Ellie. Unsure. But there's that. And then also how freaking cute is that? Oh my gosh. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed. So, I, yeah, I'm not affiliated with them in any way. I just couldn't resist. I've been looking at it for months, and this pattern just sold me. I had to get it. I can't wait to try it on. And then, I guess just the promotion that they were running was, like, I automatically got a water bottle. I don't know if it's every order or because I picked the five piece. I have no idea. But it just was automatically added to my cart was this water bottle. And it's so cute. Okay, if I can figure out how to open it. There we go. It is so cute. It says Ellie and it is like rose gold. How freaking adorable is that? So it's like that, just stainless steel. I am so obsessed. You don't even know. Like I'm, this makes me want to go to the gym right now. Am I? No, but it makes me want to. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let me try this outfit on and I will show you the ensemble. Okay. Okay. Tell me this is not the cutest thing you've ever seen in your whole life because I'm pretty sure <laughs> this is the cutest thing I've ever worn. I'm obsessed. I feel very put together. It's like you put on this outfit and suddenly you have a big savings account. Your 401k is good. You started a Roth IRA. You have your life together. You work out five times a week. You meal prep and you never forget. That's what this outfit is giving me. None of that is true. But you wouldn't know that by looking at me in this very put together outfit. Okay, so the sports bra. So cute. Love it. Well, you can't see the back, but you get the idea. 
And then it has a hood. <laughs> I am so obsessed with this. It's a problem. I never want to take this off. Morgan said I need to put on my Hollywood glasses, which are my pink ones that I always wear, the ones you just saw, and do a peace sign. And then that would be the outfit. That would be the post. I love this. I'll link them down below. Really impressed. And I love that it's Jessica Simpson. I feel like the quality is great. And it's flattering. Again, I got a large. You have to order it like the whole set in one size. I ordered a large. I think it's wonderful. Love it, love it. Okay, y'all. So, this video is sponsored by... Oh, Hutchie. <laughs> Not sponsored by Hedgie. Sponsored by Bag Smart. And you guys, I have not been more impressed with a duffel in a long time. I don't really have a lot of bags. The ones I buy are mostly from Amazon. So we can all say the quality is good, but maybe not great. Um, obviously, the price reflects that. But they sent me this cute pink duffel, which everyone needs for a little gym motivation, in my opinion. It has definitely motivated me, and I cannot wait to pack all of my new gym stuff in this bag. It's going to be so cute. So I do have a discount code if you're interested in these bags. They have this color in a lot of different styles. You can get the tote. You can get the backpack. This specific one is $55, and it is massive. It's really the size of like a good weekender, so you could take it on vacation with you. Um, tons of stuff, but let me just show you kind of all the pockets we've got. So we have this big side pocket, large pocket. This actually goes over, this isn't a pocket, this actually goes over your suitcase. So if you're traveling, you just put it right on your rolly suitcase and you're good to go. It does have this front pocket with a zipper so you can keep it closed. Another like water bottle pocket over here. The um, shoulder straps clasp together, which is great, again, for travel if you're going to end up checking this bag. Then on the inside, tons of pockets. So, again, great for the gym. You can put, like, your deodorant, your, um, like, body spray, all that kind of stuff. Change of clothes, anything you need. Also comes with a nice shoulder strap. Then over here we have a zipper as well. So, you can put your lady products or your keys or something in there. This is perfection. I will link it down below. And like I said, I do have a discount code for you. So check that out below if you're interested. They also have tons of other bags, lots of different backpacks and stuff. They have black. If you're not really a pink fan, they have this in black as well. But this is just such a soft material. And really, it's coming off a lot lighter in person or um, on camera. It's a very cute bubbly pink. I'll try to post a photo um, that's more true to its color. But I am excited. Well, I'm about to pack all my new gym stuff right inside. We're about to go to Home Depot. Um, Morgan's going to do the yard today, and we need something for his, uh, like, edger. And I am going to work on our office it's literally just a storage room right now, but it's going to be an office. Um, and so I'm going to work on that, getting going through all the crap that's just been sitting there since we moved in, finding it a home or deciding to donate it. And then um, I have a desk that I'll show you that I'm going to paint and we're going to put in there. I was a little worried it wasn't going to fit, but we just, we measured it and it's not going to fit. But, like through the doorway, but... Um, we, we saw there's a way to take, it's like an old metal teacher, teacher's desk. Um, there's a way to take off the top from the metal and the top part is the part that won't fit through the door. The like metal base will. So if we can, you know, disconnect them, then we'll be able to obviously just take the topper in on its side. So that is the plan. I'm going to paint it white and then I'm going to do the handles and like the metal um, the silver legs in like a matte gold. I think it's going to be so cute and really cool. I'm not sure what I'm going to do to the top, either paint it white, add contact paper, or just keep it wood. I'll probably have to get it in there and then decide what I think will look best, but I am very excited to get working on this project. Probably take us a few weeks to really be done with it, but I'll show you all the progress as it happens. This is the Revlon Candid, whatever you call this, um, like powder, translucent powder. 
and I just always like to do a powder to get like a you know matte finish I guess So, um, I totally forgot to film like the rest of yesterday. I filmed a little bit at the restaurant that we got sushi at, which was Kona. Um, it was really good, but all of us felt like not good today. So like we all woke up feeling sick, like us and James. So that's weird. Um, anyways, good morning. It's actually like 1250. We have done nothing today. Just had coffee. Morgan left for golf about... 45 minutes ago and I'm home about to maybe eat something and then get ready go out to my parents house me and my mom are actually gonna go Dillard's is like having a sale apparently I saw on Instagram and we're about to go to um Florida actually and I need to get some clothes for that so that's what we're gonna do. And then um, my dad's like cooking steak or whatever, so I'll just have dinner at their house. What? You missed your dad? Yes, you do. Um, anyways, at Home Depot, I picked up a couple paints. So this is the one I got for the desk. I'll show you the desk here in a minute. Probably gonna do it tomorrow, hopefully. Um, but yeah, I picked up this one in satin, just the white spray paint. I picked up two of those, a clear, thing and then gold for the um legs and like the drawer pulls and stuff the hardware of it um and then a little sheet to lay down on the garage and some painters tape of course um you know we didn't really get anything else exciting this is for our trimmer thing that like like the edger what do you call that i don't know so that's what we got at home depot um, working a little bit on the office yesterday. This is way better lighting. Um, my skin, I feel like it has been looking a lot better. Some of y'all are probably like, that's better. But yeah, I've been breaking out a lot and I feel like it looks better. Anyways, um, yeah, that's what we got going on today. Um, I'm literally so hungry and I need to take product photos of... Of the list pads so i need to get that done probably tomorrow because i want morgan to help me and i think we're gonna make a video too of them like with them i don't know we're thinking about maybe doing like a funny video like a tiktok style funny video i don't know and then i got i kind of want to do like a good one too for like youtube like as an intro or something to just kind of like announce that we're live and we're moving and grooving um, crap, we didn't eat this. Maybe we'll eat this tonight. Oh, we can eat this tomorrow. We have, oh, we have like all month. So we picked up, I don't know if I did a grocery haul or not. Um, I think I did from last week, but we got this Korean style barbecue chicken. We're really excited to try this. It's good until like all the way through September. So that's actually exciting. But we'll probably have that tomorrow Um, for dinner. We're trying to eat up a lot this week since we're leaving. Um, And yeah, that's, you know, pretty much what we've got going on. I like nothing sounds good. Like we have these chicken sausages, which I love, but like ugh, just not in the mood for it. You know what I mean? Like just nothing, nothing sounds good right now. I do want to try this today though. So I'll do a review on this. I'll probably make one here in a minute. Um, 
cold brew oat milk latte pumpkin spice by Chameleon. So we'll see if that's good. Morgan said he wants to try it too. <sighs> Don't you hate when there is nothing to eat, but like there's a ton to eat. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I've decided let's just make the cold brew. Okay. Had to bring out the orange straw because pumpkin spice. Mm -mm. Nope, don't buy this. Honestly, if I was blindfolded and you had me drink this, I would tell you that it's milk. It, it doesn't even taste like coffee and it definitely doesn't taste like pumpkin spice. Hmm. I mean, it's not gross. It just like isn't... It's creamy. Maybe I would know it's coffee, but like barely. It kind of tastes like an overly milked latte. I think they got the ratios wrong and they forgot the syrup. Not the best, bummer. Okay, so we're ready. These earrings are from Dillard's. This top is from JCPenney. I can um, link it for you. It's kind of shorter. I mean, it's pretty much like my belly button's here, so, you know, not the longest shirt. Just some jean shorts. Couldn't tell you where they're from. Had them forever. And my brown Walmart sandals. Okay, good. For Dallas. I have them in black, too. Love them. So, that's the fit. We're gonna make a coffee because two isn't enough, apparently. Two cups of coffee, I mean. So we're gonna make a protein coffee. A coffee, if you will. Isn't that what they call it on Instagram? Honestly, I don't know if it's pronounced profi or profi because it's like coffee but protein. So like profi or profi, I don't know. Either way, that's what we're making. Can you get off the counter? We don't live in a zoo. Get down. Thank you. It's like kind of a lot of ice. Oh. Okay, I'm fine. All is well. Honestly, Quest, it's just not where it's at for me. Don't love it. It just isn't like flavored, I don't know. It's just, I don't love it, to be honest. But, got the cool brew, you know the drill. We love it, we love it. Three, four. What are you crying for? What are you crying? Nobody knows. He just does that all the time. I love how pretty it looks. Like, gorgeous. How fun is that? You feel like a barista. It's just so pretty. Ah. Okay. I mean, it's still good. It's definitely better than that freaking pumpkin milk. More like, I don't know, I don't have anything funny. It's not even pumpkin milk. It literally doesn't taste like pumpkin, and it doesn't taste like coffee, so I just don't really know what they were thinking. I'm not sure who taste tested that and thought, yes, let it hit the markets. 
But if you like it, I'm so sorry. Like, no hate to you. Not gonna yuck your yum. Just to me, I, it's just not flavor. It's not enough flavor. And I like flavor. Okay. Do we have a clip bar? The last one. Don't you love when that happens? I love when that happens. Okay. Wow. What a day. I'm living off coffee and prepackaged food. You know, that is what it is. But let me put Chansey away. We're going to head to my mom's house and we're going to hit up the Dillards, y'all. Okay, let's go. Chance, come on, bring your phone. Bring your phone. Well, can you chew that? I don't know. Come on. So this has been like my go-to mask. This one's from Bucky's. Cheetah girl. And I finally got this one from Target. It's like a two pack. I put the other one in Morgan's car, so I have one. But I have bought these from Target. It's like a two pack for $4. I bought this one, like this exact print, and then it comes with a gray one in the wrong size. So now Morgan wears that larger gray one, and I gave the other one to my mom. And then um, I bought another, <laughs> another pack. And realized once I got in the car, it was again the wrong size, the large, extra large. And it's just too, um, like the ear things are too far back, you know, like it's just too much fabric. So finally, Morgan's so annoyed that I keep buying masks, but I got one. That's the right size. Yay. Is this the moment? I feel like today it's cheetah girl time. Yeah. So we're going to wear this one today. Wow. What is life that we're styling our masks? I don't know. What a weird world we live in. You know what I'm saying? Should be eating a banana, but I'm not. Okay, let's go. Okay, so I ran back in because once I got out here, it was so freaking hot. And I was just feeling like a trash human. So I went and got some ice water. Um, I'll link this cup if you're interested down below. I got it on Amazon. So, love that. And then... I got a banana. So we're gonna start with this. It's just feeling, yeah, not good. And now I'm basically the epitome of health. So. All right, see you at the stove. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. the daddy and the little baby hey girl what's up oh sweetie you're so cute hey hey bruh I want him to look up can you look up look at him oh my gosh you just chilling ah. I'm awake. How dare you? Hi, cutie. All right, let's go. So we will probably just pick up with y'all tomorrow because, I mean, Morgan's going to get home and we're going to do nothing probably. <laughs> He's probably going to play his video game and I'll play on my iPad and draw on Procreate or something or edit. I, like, got to edit always. Um... And then, yeah, tomorrow we're going to be hopefully getting stuff done, DIYs, and clean out that freaking room. I have, like, such a vision for this office, and I'm just so excited about it. So, want to push through tomorrow, try to get that um, room as cleared out as possible. My dad was saying if we wanted to come over, he would grill steaks, so... We'll just have to see. I don't know that we'll do that. We're about to all go to the beach together, so I might just hold off on that. Um, so, yeah. 
I don't know. But I have some stuff that I want to take over to my parents' house probably to like kind of store there. Okay, y'all, so here is the desk. Welcome to our messy garage. I already took out this drawer and the middle drawer, um, but we're gonna paint the metal part white, the handles gold, and then the top, I'm unsure if I'm gonna do it all white, leave it how it is, add contact paper, I just don't know yet. Um, so I'm gonna start by leaving it how it is and we'll just go from there, and then like this part will be gold and the handles obviously will be gold. So I also, that was 40 bucks I just picked it up from a school. And then these she gave me for $5 a piece. So we can put them together or separate them. I think y'all keep them together and maybe put the printer. Cause I think the printer I'm getting is pretty large. So anyways, that's what's going on. I'm about to tape it off and we'll just see how it goes. <laughs> Okay, y'all, we just made the safe and fair birthday cake blondies. I didn't really know what a blondie was, so we Googled it, and it's basically like a vanilla brownie, kind of. Um, so anyways, these are amazing. Ignore the middle one, because we um, cut into it to see if it was ready, put it back in, and then scooped out some to eat. Anyways, not the point. They're amazing. So freaking good. Actually, um, I think I have a safe and fair code. So if it's still good, I will put it in the description box below. If you want to check out their website, we love their granola, the birthday cake granola, definitely a favorite, but we are enjoying these and then I'm just going to get to work on the deck. Okay. This is my DIY face. Hi. Don't have any makeup on. Shocker. I'm wearing like the oldest clothes of life, just so if I get something on, it doesn't matter. Um, I think I'm going to start with the back side, just so I can like get the hang of it. And we'll go from there. Okay, so I just did the drawers, took the hardware off, went ahead and painted just like the faces and the edges. So those are looking good. I've got the handles laid out here and I'm about to put the gold on. 